Yesterday was certainly a day of craziness when it comes to quarterbacks in the NFL. And there were three most notable quarterbacks that were on the move. Two of them are future Hall of Famers that for the first time in their careers are wearing dorms. I mean, let's start with Teddy Bridgewater three-year contract to go from New Orleans to Carolina. This pretty much means that Cam Newton is most likely out. Um, Teddy Bridgewater is the guy that stepped up when Drew Brees was out due to injury. So, you know, congratulations to him on his new contract with a new team. Now we go into the big stuff. Philip Rivers after, you know, two decades of being with the San Diego slash Los Angeles Chargers is now an Indianapolis Colt. As I said in my video yesterday, it's weird to see these future Hall of Famers who've known one team finishing out their careers with different teams. For Phillip Rivers, a one-year deal to go to the Indianapolis Colts. This comes almost a year after Andrew Luck's shocking announcement that he was retiring. And then we get into the biggest news of all. The greatest of all time, Tom Brady signing with the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. I mean, sure we can look forward to Breeze versus Brady kind of like Brady versus Manning, but man, I mean, this turns the NFL on its head. It turns the NFC picture on its head. It really makes the NFC South even more competitive. It's just insane for me to say that. So... You know, what does this mean now for the Patriots? What does it mean for the Chargers? Do they pursue guys like Cam Newton or Jameis Winston? Do they look to the draft? I mean, you know, with a guy like Justin Herbert there. You, then you got um, whatever his name, who I can't even pronounce. Um, you know, I don't know. Would have been a top five pick if he hadn't suffered that season ending injury last year. I mean, does he go to New England in the dra via the draft? Does Justin Herbert go as a, to the Chargers via the draft? It's going to be crazy. Uh, quarterbacks are definitely on the move, folks. Even the Chicago Bears.